getpretty.com. And we're thinking about summer. Yeah, it's really hot. It is. I'm hungry. Me too. Let's make dessert. Okay. Strawberry pretzel dessert. That's really good. We should make it. Do we have the stuff? Oh, we do have the stuff. This is a lot of stuff. Cream cheese, sugar, butter, small pretzels, strawberry jello, more sugar, small pieces of chocolate, our favorite frozen berries. Cool. What do we do first? Crush up these pretzels in a plastic bag. This is good exercise. Those look really crushed up. Yeah. Now it's time to melt the butter. Look, it's melted. That was fast. Now we're going to put it in this bowl. Let's make the crust. Okay. Will you please add the pretzels to the butter? And I'll get the sugar. This is brown sugar. That looks like a good amount. This looks gross. This looks really mixed. Yeah, let's dump it in the pan. The only problem with the dessert is that it usually doesn't have chocolate in it. How can we fix that? Let's put some chocolate in it. Let's put some chocolate. Let's put some chocolate in right now. Okay. Okay. Are those mini chocolate chips? Yeah, they're smaller than normal size ones. Smaller things always taste sweeter than the original size of that thing. And it's the same for chocolate. I'm going to put just enough chocolate. That's not enough. This is not enough chocolate. Is that enough chocolate? It's just enough chocolate. Wow, this oven is like 375 degrees hot. I'm gonna put this in for about eight minutes. While your pretzel crust is baking, you can get the jello part ready. To this bowl, we're going to add two packages of strawberry jello gelatin. Then you need to add two cups of boiling water. We like to buy pre-boiled water. Now it's time to add the frozen fruit. You can use about 10 ounces of any frozen fruit you like. We're using strawberries and raspberries that we picked ourselves. Mm. <laughs> that was messy. <laughs> this looks mixed up perfectly. Now we're going to put it in the refrigerator and let it chill. I think our crust is about done. Now it's time to make the other part of our filling. We're going to start with the cream cheese. And we'll extrude it directly into our mixing bowl. That looks good. Then we need one cup of sugar. That's a lot of sugar. That looks about right. Then one tub of whipped topping. Now we're going to spread all of this cream cheese layer over top of our pre-made, already made pretzel crust. strawberry jello raspberry topping. It's really red. Yum. This looks delicious. Now all I have to do is refrigerate it overnight. It's finished. And luckily there's still a little bit left. Crazy, I'm crazy for 